Prince George may be the eldest of the three Wales children, but according to the late Queen, it's Princess Charlotte who's the boss. Today, many happy returns to Charlotte, with the royals celebrating turning nine. Her birthday portrait this year is filled with a very special emotional meaning that reflects the deep bond between the young princess and the late Queen Elizabeth II. Ever since her birth, the Wales' mid-child has become one of the most popular members of the royal family, with fans delighted whenever they go to see her during the royal occasion or outing. And nothing could be more wonderful as one of the major gifts in her life that came from her late great-grandmother that caused a major change in the line of succession. At the time of Princess Anne's birth, the succession of the Crown Act meant that once her two younger brothers were born, she was then pushed down the line. But this didn't happen to Charlotte. As we had said, her mother, Princess Catherine, has sought to maintain the tradition of commemorating her children's birthday by posting a portrait that she's captured herself. Royal fans have expressed their delight and collectively pointed out how grown up Princess Charlotte looks in the adorable new photograph. She is seen beaming with a cute smile, posing next to Clematis Elizabeth flowers, which were named after the late Queen Elizabeth II. These flowers were among the first plants to be named after the late monarch, and bloom in spring and early summer. Queen Elizabeth II's love of gardening was no secret as she was sponsored by the RHS for more than seven decades. Charlotte's Gangan attended the iconic Chelsea Flower Show more than 50 times during her long reign. No doubt Catherine's choice to photograph her daughter next to the Clematis Elizabeth flowers for Princess Charlotte's birthday portrait it was a nice tribute to Queen Elizabeth II. Charlotte strikes me as quite a confident young lady, but the two brothers, she will no doubt be looking to her mother and other women in the family as role models, from her great-grandmother the Queen to her own mum. Indeed, Princess Charlotte's connection to the Queen goes beyond their family ties. One video has resurfaced again as the little princess celebrates her birthday, and Kensington Palace released a very special photograph containing a tribute to the late Elizabeth II. Even though the video dates back to December 2019, royal fans have been delighted with the behavior of little Charlotte. During the traditional walk, many people gather to watch family members pass by. It was at that moment when a royal observer beckoned Charlotte, then four years old, with outstretched arms. Without hesitation, the little princess paused briefly before reaching out and hugging the stranger in a touching display of affection. With the message, She's the cutest girl accompanying the video. Viewers couldn't resist commenting on the princess's spontaneous and innocent gesture. Although some expressed concern about the appropriateness of a stranger hugging a child, Princess Kate did not object to the interaction. Her great-grandmother once remarked on the princess's protective personality back in January 2018, when Charlotte was just two years old and her brother George was four. At the time, she was presenting a book to a 10-year-old student, Emily Clay. When the queen asked the student if she looked after her younger sister, Emily's mother replied, it's the other way around, to which the monarch replied, it's like that with Charlotte and George. The young daughter of Prince William and Princess Catherine inherited her great-grandmother's love of horses, a passion that Charlotte symbolically acknowledged during the monarch's funeral in September 2022, when she wore a horseshoe brooch gifted to her by her great-grandmother. As a sweet nod to her late great-grandmother, Charlotte was given the middle name of Elizabeth. She was also given Diana as a middle name, which is her late paternal grandmother, Princess Diana's name.